I'm Max Fagan, I'm a BE here at Thayer, and uh, this is an ejection seat from a fighter aircraft. Deactivated, don't worry. I, I know every boy goes through a phase in their life where they want to be an astronaut, and I, I guess I just really never grew out of it. It's the only thing I've ever wanted to be, is a space explorer. Uh, Vassar, I studied physics and astronomy. I was a double major in the physics and astronomy department. Vassar runs the dual degree program with Dartmouth, and so I came here for my junior and post-senior year to do mechanical engineering. For our Engines 8990 project, the capstone engineering project, um, I was on a design team which did a design project for the NASA Glenn Research Center. We were designing a new subsystem for the life support, com for the life support systems on next generation spacecraft. The challenge in spacecraft is when you exhale, when you exercise, when you perspirate, you put humidity into the cabin air and there's nowhere for it to go. Now on the space shuttle and the International Space Station, they have a system for that and it works, but it's heavy, clunky, it has this very large centrifuge to simulate the effects of gravity. And the system that we're designing does away with all moving components entirely. It uses a block of specially treated porous graphite, which works kind of like a sponge. You blow moist air at it and it literally sucks the water right out of the air without the need for a centrifuge. Until I actually get into space, this is both conditionally and um, physically the closest that I will have ever been to space. I certainly think there will be a mission to Mars in my, in my career. Whether I'm on it, I realize that's a long shot, but that doesn't mean it's not a, it's not a chance I want to take.